Hey, this is your boy, Laddie Boy, with just another um, easy drama tutorial. And this time I'm going to be talking more on how I can um, about the kits. But not only the kits, a lot of stuff you could do beyond the, the kits, you know, with easy drama. Um, you know, you have the grooves, you have the grid editor, which I'm going to get into, the mixer, then you have where you can import loops in here. But today I'm going to actually be working with some drums. And as you can see here, we got different drums. Um, let me see if I get this right. You got the Studio Basic. You got different drum setups. But apart from the different drum kits that you can get, and there's a whole lot of kits um, here that you can get, I want to also say that you can get, you can individually change the let's say um okay let me go back this is the snare so you have all these different snares variation and i think they're different um different snares from different companies and so as a tom his can change a tom get a different song they don't have that many options there but one of the cool things um you can do let's see here is importing your own files in here which i find very interesting because um with this i could build my own kits with my own drums if i want to even if you and i must say the drums in easy drummer 3 they're top of the line drums they were very well recorded very well produced and the songs is unbelievable i mean if um uh, Let's see, let's go to Studio Pop Kit. So you can see that the drums are top of the line, top of the line drums. Um, that has really good songs for any genre of music that you may be working with um but one of the cool things that i also like about what they did in in easy drummer 3 which i haven't actually export explore in easy drummer 2 yet is that i could put whatever song they want in there go to my kick drum so go and import a file and right here, I have some UK kicks, UK drill kit kicks. I could like listen to the song, bam, drop it in here. So you see, I have um, so many options. I have a snare here. If I don't want a snare, I can go and bring in my own. Let's see, in my desktop. Snares. So I can bring, I can bring my own shit into um easy drama you know and this is like so important you know so i could change the art of things and get my own songs in there instead of just working with their stuff 
It gives me the opportunity to work with some of my own stuff also, which is cool. You know, I like that. Um, and also that goes for the precautions. I can, there's a lot more stuff here, like cowbells, stamp, but I can also, um, I think I can import. Let's see. Will they give a good list here? No, I think I thought I could. But without a doubt, I can import actually um percussion song that I would like to use. That is not in easy drummer I could bring my own files in here and um and these are just um some kits I download there's not even actual samples that you could have all sort of samples on your on your um your computer and just bring them in you know which is a cool thing to so like this clap I could put that particular clap and you know, other percussion instruments, you know, which is cool. I, I really love this. It makes it more not just for a drum maker and include anything I want basically in here, you know. Let's see. Whether it be a sample or one shot. So that's a really cool um, thing. I like that because then I can. And on top of that, then I could actually use these things. And program them onto um and program them in here, you know. So instead of just having to rely on their drums, I could basically program like um set a tempo of let's say a hundred um, put on the click and fire away. But I can't hit all. You know, so it's it it, it makes it more like a DAW with things you can do with the drums, you know. So I could build my drums um, similar to the on like on the grid editor to your own style, similar to like what's happening in um, the MPC or any other nice drum shit man and it's really cool this let me just take this off so i could put go ahead put a snare there i can go and write in some hi-hats in there Cross which is cool, you know. So that's a little bit of the drums in the drum ender, but what I'm actually getting at is not so much that, it's more that you could 
bring your own shit in here and build your own kits the way you want them. You don't have to rely on and just limited. You're not just limited to the songs that Easy Drama has. You could bring your own shit in and create your own hip hop kits, your own reggae kits, your own compa kit, any kind of kit you want, man. So Hope you guys enjoy this video. If you like this video, hit me up. I'll be putting out some more stuff on Easy Drama 3. Um, at the moment, I can't use it in Reason 12 because Easy Drama 3 is VSD3, which is not supported in Reason. But I can build my drum kits outside and um, export my files and bring them into Reason as audio files and work from there, which is another option. But that's for another um, tutorial. But this one is basically about getting your own songs and putting them in here and, and using your own shit. So if you like this video, hit me up, man. Peace out.